Strange medical anomalies. Broken heart syndrome. This is when you experience a traumatic event such as the death of a loved one, causing your body to release high levels of the stress hormone cortisol. The levels of cortisol get so high that they rapidly weaken your heart, temporarily interfering with its function. Symptoms include chest pain and shortness of breath, and in severe cases, the heart can become completely paralyzed, leading to death. Aquagenic urticaria. This is sometimes known as water allergy, and it's when someone develops hives on the skin after contact with water, regardless of its temperature. When they drink water, it can result in the swelling of the mouth and throat, and in extreme cases, can cause anaphylaxis. Hypertrichosis. This is characterized by an abnormal amount of hair growth over the body. There are two types. One causes hair to grow over the entire body, and the other is restricted to a certain area. It's extremely rare and caused by a genetic mutation, and in the 19th century, circuses used to hire people with this condition as side freaks. Fish odor syndrome. This is a metabolic disorder that's caused by a defect in the normal production of an enzyme. When not enough of this enzyme is present, the body loses its ability to break down the fishy smelling chemical called trimethylamine during digestion. Trimethylamine then builds up in the person's body and is released in their sweat, urine, and breath, giving off a fishy odor. Congenital insensitivity to pain. This is when a person cannot feel or has never felt physical pain in their life. It's an extremely dangerous condition because pain is a warning sign that something is wrong, so the inability to feel it could lead to serious consequences, such as burning yourself without even realizing it. It's believed to be caused by the increased production of endorphins in the brain, which is the neurotransmitter that blocks pain signals. Fibrodysplasia ossificans progressiva. This is a condition where connective tissues such as muscle, tendons, and ligaments turn into bones, the only known medical condition where one organ system changes into another. There's currently no cure for it, and either spontaneously or when damaged as the result of trauma, joints will become fused and form new bones replacing damaged muscle tissue. They eventually form a secondary skeleton, which progressively restricts the patient's ability to move. And in the instance where this extra bone has been surgically removed, the body will just go ahead and repair the affected area with additional bone, earning it the nickname Stone Man Disease. Epidermodysplasia verusiformis or tree man's disease. This is the result from an abnormal susceptibility to HPV infections, causing excessive growth of warts and skin lesions. It typically begins in childhood or in young adulthood and leads to a higher lifetime risk of skin cancer. Foreign Accent Syndrome. This develops usually as a result from a stroke, head trauma, migraines, or developmental problems, and it is characterized by developing a foreign accent that's different from their native after some form of trauma occurs to the brain. Mobius Syndrome. This is a rare disorder characterized by facial paralysis and the inability to move the eyes from side to side. Some people can't even close their eyes or form facial expressions like smile or frown, and as a result, they're sometimes perceived as unfriendly or dull people, when in reality, they simply just can't move their facial muscles at all. Hyperexplexia. This is when someone has an uncontrolled and exaggerated startle response to touch and sound, causing their body to stiffen and sometimes leading them to fall over. Exploding head syndrome. This is when someone hallucinates an incredibly loud explosion sound such as gunshots or a car accident in their head as they're trying to fall asleep. Some people can have it up to seven times per night, leading to sleep disruption and insomnia. Elephantiasis. This is caused by a tropical parasitic infection that's transmitted by mosquitoes. It results in the enlargement and hardening of limbs like the legs. The tissue will fill with fluid and the muscles will break down, causing extreme pain and discomfort. Auto brewery syndrome. This is when someone doesn't properly digest carbohydrates, causing them to ferment in the gastrointestinal tract. This fermentation leads to the buildup of ethanol in the stomach, which then produces intoxicating effects. So these people, quite literally, can get drunk from eating a loaf of bread. The Hogan Sisters Krista and Tatiana Hogan are conjoined twins who are joined at the head and share a skull and a brain. Their nervous systems are highly interconnected, and when one twin is tickled, the other one jumps up. Or when one of them puts a pacifier in their mouth, the other one stops crying. Not only that, but they can feel and taste what the other is experiencing, and it was later discovered that they can see through each other's eyes. Osteogenesis imperfecta. This is when someone has incredibly fragile and brittle bones. Someone with this condition could break their bones 50 times or so doing simple things like sitting on the couch or brushing their teeth. Locked-in syndrome, also known as pseudocoma. This is when someone is paralyzed in nearly all voluntary muscles except for the eyes. They can't even speak. They're fully aware and have no loss of cognitive function, they just can't move at all. Some may be able to communicate with others by blinking their eyes to Morse code or something similar, and it's primarily caused by a traumatic brain injury. Synesthesia. This is when a stimulus can trigger multiple sensory pathways, so someone may be able to experience colors while listening to music, or taste words. Visual agnosia. 
This is when someone has an impaired ability to recognize objects. For example, they may be looking at a hat and can't identify the object for what it is, despite repeated exposure to this object throughout their life. It's not that they can't remember it or don't have the language to describe it, but for some reason their brain just can't make the connection. Harlequin ichthyosis. This genetic disorder results in thickened skin over nearly the entire body. It starts at birth and the skin forms large diamond-shaped plates that are separated by deep cracks, so their skin is almost scales. And people with this condition need to constantly exfoliate or they can lose fingers and toes to infection. So, unfortunately, they have to rub their skin raw basically every day, causing extreme discomfort. Disembarkment Syndrome This is when someone feels persistently dizzy, usually following a cruise or other motion experience. In severe cases, someone may get off a boat or a plane and experience internal balance issues for the rest of their life, getting nauseated from simple tasks. Lupus. This is an autoimmune disorder in which the immune system, which normally protects your body from disease, attacks its own tissues. This causes inflammation and even permanent damage, and can affect the skin, joints, heart, kidneys, and brain. So pretty much, your body's immune system goes into hyperdrive and tries to kill you. Well, that's going to do it. Hopefully you learned something new. If you enjoy these types of videos, make sure to subscribe. I post one to two times a week, so there's always going to be some fresh content coming out. And thank you all for watching.